All right, here we are with the continuation of Super Bomberman. And like, yeah. I shut down my emulator, so the enemy layout might be a little bit different here now from when we shut off the game last time. And all my power-ups will be gone. So, <laughs> yeah. You know, I had to leave the game and I did not make a save state. So, yeah. From now on, I'll probably be making a save state at the beginning of each video, you know, so, just so that we don't have to regain our power-ups here. So yeah, but this here is World 3. Um, these little green guys, as you can see, will dig through the ground and appear wherever they want to. Which, I'm not a big fan of that. Not gonna lie. And I'd like to kill these green balls here. Mm. Okay. <coughs> What a power-up to get. The red bomb. Like, this is a very powerful bomb. Like, as you can see, it will explode right through blocks. So, clearing things will be immensely much faster. Like, it's not even funny how nice this bomb here is. Like, it's on par with the remote bomb. Uh, like, it's so strong. The remote bomb is naturally better against bosses, you know, and the like, but... This here is not bad either. Like, it certainly is a lot faster when you're trying to clear a stage. Like, yeah, especially if you have a lot of firepower, which I tend to not like to have, you know, but... Even if you only have like four, you know, squares of explosion, three or four, like, it can still do some real damage. Nope, oh, okay. I was going to be greedy there, but let's not be greedy. And am I screwed? I'm screwed. I already lost my power up. <laughs> Damn it. Okay, nice. You got revenge on him. But yeah, this here is not ideal. Oh my god. I really wish I had made that save state. This is going to be so tough now. Hooga looga. Um, yeah. How do we do this? Let's just try and get lucky here. Damn it! <laughs> Dude, this is going to be so hard now. Nice, okay. Nice! Wow, he tried to get a surprise sneak attack in on me there, but, but he just kind of killed himself. But yeah, very nice. Now we got two bombs as well. That's gonna help a ton, and the kicking power up too is going to make this a lot easier. Oh my god. Oh no! Dude, how is this fair? How is this fair, game? What the hell? Uh... How do I do this? Oh my god. Oh my... Dude, this is just... This is... This is so bad. Um... At least now I can move around, I guess. Please come, 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 come. Nope. Oh my god. <laughs> what the hell, dude? The game got brutal all of a sudden. Oh my god. Oh, yeah. I really could have needed my power ups here in this world. Just look how many bomb eaters there are still around here too. And to make things worse, we had these digging guys, you know, <laughs> going around. The alien diggers. Wow, that's a terrible name. <laughs> but yeah, at the very least, the two remaining bomb guys are locked in, so... I can deal with them separately. And yeah, what's kind of fascinating about this game is I believe that every time like you start a new campaign, like everything is randomly uh, randomly generated. So like that makes it so enemies does not spawn in every, you know, in the same place each time. So 
yeah, it can be quite tricky like that and sometimes the game will just give you very hard seeds. I guess I got a hard seed here. Like, I started with the bobber eater, or with the bomb eater, you know. So close to me, which, uh, safe to say, is not ideal. Ooh, nice. That's going to be very helpful. So how do we tackle this? I guess we just do this. And then we have to be very careful here. Get into a nice rhythm, and nice. Now then, I'm going to go up here and... What, what am I doing? Oh my, okay. Jesus, I need to start paying attention that... If I play like this in the later levels, you know, <laughs> it won't be pretty. Oh my god, I'm running out of time. Wow. This is a disaster. Oh, okay. Yeah. So now I don't have the punching anymore. That's awful. Let's just try and... Try and lead this guy over here and destroy him. Okay. Yeah. This game is quite a bit harder than I remember it being, I have to say. Of course, you know, had I not lost my power-ups there, you know, from the last video, <laughs> this would have been a lot easier, but yeah. It is what it is. I'm just going to have to try and regain my lost power there. Hmm, interesting. I actually don't remember these blue enemies at all. But yeah, this world seems very easy, or this stage, I should say. Unless these blue guys do something really nasty, like besides going through walls, but it doesn't look like it. Yeah, let's just open it up. Oh, apple. The apple gives points, and I got an extra life. Which I very much welcome. Yeah, nice. And this level, for some reason, is very generous with bomb pickups here. Wow, yeah, yeah, a ton of bombs now. Well, that's nice. That will speed things up here. I should just try and move things along a little bit quicker here, so I don't run out of time and lose yet another health, another health, uh, another extra guy there. Oh, he almost ran into that. Die! Yes! Yes, yes, yes. Very nice. Oh, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> I almost killed myself there. Huh? Nice. He could not have appeared in a better spot. <laughs> okay, but yeah, this... Ooh, look at that! That power-up! That power-up is nasty. I'll pick it up just to show it, but when you pick up the golden explosive power-up... Hurry! Run! Oh my god, I almost killed myself. <sighs> I really don't like this power-up all that much, but basically it gives you maximum firepower just from that one pickup. Um, and I just wanted to showcase it. <laughs> Whew, but yeah, I almost killed myself there. <laughs> oh... Okay, here we have the factory part of this world, I guess. Yeah, more enemies moving through walls. Um. Oh my god, and they take so many hits! Three hits! I thought he was going to die there from the second hit. Wow. I actually... Yeah, I, I did not remember he took that many hits. I guess all enemies here take more hits than before. These freaking cone guys take three hits. The hard hat guys take two, I believe. Are you guys? Okay, I can't waste time like this. I need to speed this up. Nice. Let's just put a bomb there for safety. Nice. Man. Oh, and also the 
max power there seems to only last for the level where you pick it up. <laughs> and I'm running out of time again. Time to step this up. Good. Damn it, he backed out. Nice. Dead. Okay, I should have this. I should have this. Just do not explode the goal here. And <laughs> I should be fine. Let's just try and box him in. Nice. Okay. Quickly move out of here. There we go. <laughs> Almost thought the goal was bugged there for a second. 3-5. Oh, here we have the bull enemies. Um, as soon as you step into their line of sight, they will try and bomb rush you down. But they only take one hit. Interesting. I thought for sure they would take two or three hits. But yeah, like... Ooh, time. See, when you get a time power up, <laughs> you probably don't want to pick it up at once. You know, let it lie there for a little bit and then you can pick it up. You know. So that you can power up farm for as long as possible. I mean, unless there is some enemy that will try to destroy the power up for you. And that was stupid of me. I could have easily been hurt there. And I never thought I would say this, but... <laughs> I really... I really wouldn't mind getting a nice... Uh, I really would not mind getting a firepower upgrade here now. This is quite quite ridiculous and I I want that. Ooh, extra life. I want that too. Well, you know, I have to admit, things are looking much better now. Much better than they were just a moment ago. Like, no, we're starting to stack up some power-ups again and I'll make sure to make a save state, you know, just so that uh, yeah, just so that I don't have to start over like this again. I mean, if I get a game over, I mean, obviously I won't just reload the freaking save state like a chump and cheat, uh, you know. <laughs> but, you know, just just as a safe backup in case I shut the game down or I want to leave my, my house or whatever, you know. Just for those kind of purposes. Ooh, the chameleon guys here. I don't really remember what they do, but... Oh, that's what I do. <laughs> Huh, I can't believe I forgot about that. That seems quite a... Uh, well, that is quite a unique feature. <laughs> okay. But yeah. Nice. Yeah, but they are not all that hard. Like, I guess if you're playing with a friend, like, if you're playing co-op single player, then they might confuse you. But, in single player mode, yeah, they do not pose much of a threat unless you're confusing yourself with one of them. But if you do that, yeah, <laughs> you just have yourself to blame. <laughs> Ooh. Or, no, you know what, I want my remote bombs. They are very helpful right now, I have to say. Let's just do this. Boom, and... See, now, now we have a combo here. We'll let him out, and then we'll explode him. Boom. Okay. Boom. Alright. No power-ups there. And just one single pellet of time left. Cutting it very close. Huh. Okay. Well, I like the look of this. We have very easy enemies to deal with here, once again. I do not fear the chameleon guys all that much, I have to say. They are quite tame. Like, yeah, quite tame. <laughs> but there really isn't much else to say about them. And the bull guys, you know, sure they can charge at you. But, yeah, look at this, they aren't. Yeah, they are not all that fast, you know. And finally, finally a skate power up. Ooh, and the kick. The kick, the kick. 
And here we have a free kill. Nice. I actually tried to explode the bull, but <laughs> yeah, that works well as well. Okay. And once again, no power up. Po power up, power up. <laughs> so we'll just move on here. We did get the skate power up though, which is, yeah, very nice. And yeah, this boss, this boss is awesome. <laughs> He's got his little claw shooting out. It's that professor guy controlling him. Like the, I guess he's the antagonist of this game. Or well, there is actually two bad guys. Um, but this guy is like the, well, yeah. He's one of the main guys, one of the main antagonists. And yeah, be careful of these guys coming around here. They will explode. What? What the hell? What? No way! Detonated the bomb! Oh my god. But yeah, okay, that's what I do. I misremembered completely. I thought I thought they would explode when you when you blew them up, but that is clearly not the case. Oh my god, dude, this is This is hard. Yeah. This is like the first boss that's actually going to challenge you, I'd say. Like his claws are very deadly and all those you know, his helpers here. Yeah, they are nasty. You probably don't want to lay too many bombs here. And yeah, it seems he can only have three at a time, so that's nice at least. So I'll probably not try and focus them, I'll just aim for the boss here. And you know, look at this class so that he doesn't get me here. But yeah. I remember, like, this boss <laughs> have given me tons of problems in the past, like, he's not easy, you just gotta be very calm, you know, try and not be scared of the bombs moving around and, you know, don't stay in the line of the claws, and like, I don't even try to aim too much for him, I just kind of put bombs down at random and, you know, usually he just goes into them, and if he yeah, if one of his bombs comes at you, like, just put down a bomb on yourself and, you know, they won't be able to touch you, basically. I believe, anyway. I, I would hope so. <laughs> I can't. I, I honestly can't remember. <laughs> but, yeah. The most important thing is that you just try and keep calm and, you know, focus on the boss, not so much on the bombs there. But, yeah. So very, it's, a, it's a very interesting boss fight, that's for damn sure. Oh yeah, and this stage. <laughs> I actually love this world. I love the music here. <laughs> great stuff, great stuff. But yeah, I'll see you in the next one. <laughs> Thank you for watching everyone. Take care.